environment in their area. And so they have also had this coal seam gas come to town, the threat of it, and she's been very active in the last year setting up CSG Free Hawkesbury because of course with water it comes from all many many places and for Sydney it comes through our dams but in many areas it comes you know to create the conditions that they can actually grow food and the Hawkesbury is the market garden for Sydney. Thanks Isabel. Thanks to the organisers of this very inspiring walk it's been really enjoyable joining in on this last thing. I just want to acknowledge that all of the book has been on the lands of the Aboriginal people and here it's the Gadigal people and in our area in the Hawkesbury it's the Dharal people so I just want to acknowledge those people and their elders past and present. Uh, the Hawkesbury Environment Network has been going for a few years and what we do out in the Hawkesbury area uh, where we have the Hawkesbury The mic closer. But Isabel just said yeah. is uh, it's one of, one of the areas where a lot of the food for Sydney is grown so the water is very important. With uh, the Hawkesbury Environment Network does a lot of on-ground environmental work where we do bush regeneration and uh, try to look after our lagoons and our water supply for the people who live there and for the crops that are grown. Um, recently because we have had a CSG free Hawkesbury campaign um, one of the um, achievements I think that we could we could say that we assisted in recently was that the Gloucester uh, CSG uh, flowback water was initially sent to Newcastle to be treated and Newcastle rejected it and then after that the um, AGL uh, wanted to bring this flowback water down to the Hawkesbury. We have a recycling depot worth recycling in the Hawkesbury um, who are, ha are licensed to treat fairly toxic water. But the people of the Hawkesbury didn't want this CSG flowback water to be delivered to our area and potentially pumped out into our farms and our sewage system. So we held some rallies, we talked to people and uh, we, along with a lot of other community groups we um, have, at the moment anyway, managed to prevent this CSG flowback water from being delivered to the Hawkesbury. Okay, thanks everyone.